Ready? Yeah. My name is Linda Morris, and I'm a wellness consultant with Nikon, and I have been for many years. And I have a friend that asked me about wanting to lose weight several years ago, and I found out about this doctor's plan. And over the years, I've added other information from different doctors to this plan, and it became what I call the last diet you'll ever need to learn plan. And when Nikon came out with the Kenzen Vital Balance about two years ago, we started incorporating this plan with our, our team. And we've had great results, and a lot of people don't understand how it works, so I have a PowerPoint that people were wanting to have available on YouTube. So before you get started, and feel free to pause at any time, for yourself, you want to have a five pound bag of sugar. You want a four cup uh, glass measuring cup that you can, uh, and then you also need tablespoons to, to scoop sugar in because we're going to show you what happens when you eat black eyed peas or black beans, uh, oatmeal, different things like that. So you have a better perspective of what's happening in your body, even though when you read the label, it may say there is no sugar within. So let's get started. We're going to start off with the PowerPoint. And uh, like I said, if you're scooping sugar and somebody's taking too long, you can push pause and then push play again. So our problem today is what we're going to look at. The problem today is obesity, fatigue, and cognitive function. And we've actually found that more people are more concerned about their memory issues than they are about weight loss once they find out that there is a possible solution to helping with their memory issues. Another interesting point is every pound of fat that you gain produces seven miles of new blood vessels. Imagine what burden those few little extra pounds you joke about can put on your heart. On the positive side, every pound you lose results in a four pound reduction in knee joint load or knee pressure. If you lost 10 pounds, you could have a total of 48,000 less pounds of pressure for every mile walked. On the Vital Balance Eating Program, you will transform your body's ability to digest sugars properly by regulating your insulin level. It's like giving your pancreas a well-deserved break or a vacation by cutting out simple and complex carbs until you've reached your weight loss goal. This is a real solution to these problems, not some yo-yo diet and certainly not diet pills to further mess up your metabolism. We look for lasting results with real wholesome foods, teaching you key lessons that empower you to get results. On average, women lose weight at the rate of three to five pounds per week, and men, four to seven pounds per week. Lesson number one, learn to live off your body's own fat reserves. Your body gets its energy from three reserves, carbohydrates, proteins, and fats. The body first burns energy from its simple and complex carbohydrate reserves and when depleted turns simultaneously to its protein and fat reserves for energy. Lesson number two, your body only stores three days worth of carbs. Because of this, the Vital Balance Diet has a beginning and an end, like a treatment. Until you reach 100% of your weight loss goal, we restrict all sugars from your diet. Even healthy fruits and those vegetables that have a high sugar content, such as corn, potatoes, beets, peas, carrots, and the like. Four grams of carbohydrates is equal to one teaspoon of sugar. As long as sugar is entering your system, you're not burning fat. It's as simple as that. Remember, your body first takes its energy from your carb reserves. The idea is to deplete your carb reserves completely in order to get your body to turn to its fat to burn calories. When you put too many grams of carbs into your system, your pancreas senses danger. It completely zeroes up the danger with the uh, insulin. Your body realizes it has no more sugar, then craves more sugar. You eat more carbohydrates and too many actually, and the vicious cycle is on and repeating. So how do we get the body to burn its fat reserves and not its muscle mass reserves if both are depleted simultaneously? By providing your body with foods that have a very high protein value, complete with nutrients, essential amino acids, 98% plus absorbable, which makes them biologically complete proteins. We supplement your body with whole food nutrient rich supplements such as multivitamins, calcium, magnesium, potassium, which is the key ingredient in muscle building and electrolytes to replace those normally found in foods restricted on the eating plan. So this is just from my cupboard. You know, it's just a group of food. You know, it's from cereal to oatmeal to black beans, uh, raisins, spaghetti, spaghetti sauce, things like that. And from that, I created an eating plan. 
And we are gonna go through that now so you really understand what's happening in your body when you eat these foods. So you wanna make sure you have your teaspoons and your sugar because you're gonna be scooping. And this will be the biggest aha around food that you may have ever had. It's quite enlightening. So let's look at a typical American healthy breakfast. Often we start off with an eight ounce glass of orange juice. That's what we were taught. That's equal to 26 grams of carbs, which is six and a half teaspoons of sugar. There's three teaspoons in one tablespoon. So I converted it into tablespoons just to make it easier on your wrist. So that is equal to just a little over two tablespoons, that one eight ounce glass of orange juice. One cup of eat oatmeal is 54 grams of carbs. If you look at the label that says there's no sugar in it, that's actually equal to 13 and a half teaspoons of sugar, which is a little, it's about four and a half tablespoons. One eighth of a cup of raisins, because that's how my dad taught me to make it. And that's 15 grams of carbs, which is uh, just a little over one tablespoon. Two teaspoons of brown sugar, which is eight grams of carbs, that is two teaspoons of sugar. And one piece of whole grain toast is 44 grams of carbs, which is 11 teaspoons of sugar. That's almost four tablespoons. Th that breakfast total is 147 grams of carbs, almost 37 teaspoons of sugar. And when you, we are looking to reduce our weight, limiting our carbs to as low as possible is necessary to burn fat. Say you need 30 to 50 grams of carbs a day. That's about seven to 12 teaspoons of sugar a day. And this is what that looks like. This is 37 teaspoons of sugar. You can see it's right, almost one cup of sugar. And uh, other than the two teaspoons of sugar, we didn't actually put any sugar into our into this day, this breakfast. Pretty enlightening. So next we're gonna go to uh, black beans and rice. A lot of people, a lot of people around the world, this is what they eat often. Two cups of black beans is 248 grams of carbs. That's equal to 62 teaspoons of sugar, which is 21 tablespoons. So start scooping that sugar into the measuring cup right now because it's gonna take you a little while and you might wanna hit pause until you're done. Yes, black beans also have protein. They also have other nutrients and fiber, but there is nothing that can make up for 62 grams of carbohydrates in Wow, it's just crazy. So uh, now we're gonna add the one cup of brown rice, which a lot of people are, that's what they think is the bad part of this uh, meal. Well, it's only 66 grams of carbs, which is 16 and a half teaspoons of sugar or five and a half tablespoons. Cuban bread, half a loaf. Well, Cuban bread here in Florida is about eight inches long. So let's say four inches of Cuban bread. That's 112 grams of carbs. 28 teaspoons of sugar and nine and a third tablespoons. This lunch total is 426 grams of carbs, 106 teaspoons of sugar. This is what that looks like. And at this point, your body is saying danger, danger, danger. If you keep eating like this, you may need to be on medication. And I don't think that's, you know, that's not in your plan, is it? In fact, that's a heavy cup of sugar. Actually, it's about two and a half cups of sugar in that one meal. That's how your, your body's looking at what you just put into it. Dinner, spaghetti and meatballs. Spaghetti pasta doesn't really matter if it's regular or gluten-free. A quarter box, 46 grams of carbs, 11 and a half teaspoons, that's 3.8 tablespoons of sugar. So let's just say four. Spaghetti sauce, half a cup. You know, spaghetti is made from tomato, which is a fruit. It's 13 grams of carbs, and it's just a little over one tablespoon. Homemade meatballs without the breadcrumbs or the bread is six grams of carbs, one and a half teaspoons of sugar. You can have as many of those as you want because that's, uh, that's not adding to your carb load. Two small slices of garlic bread, 42 grams of carbs, nine and a half teaspoons of sugar. That's another three tablespoons. Two glasses of wine because sometimes you just gotta have a little fun. That's 42 grams of carbs, which is nine and a half teaspoons of sugar. That's another three tablespoons. One slice of cheesecake, 33 grams of carbs. This is a plain cheesecake. It's not the one with the turtle sauce on top. That's eight and a quarter teaspoons of sugar, and that's just about three tablespoons. So for this meal, that is 182 
grams of carbs. That's 45 and a half teaspoons of sugar. So that's just a little over a cup that you've been scooping. Now let's just go and look at the day total. So day total is uh, 755 grams of carbs, 188 teaspoons of sugar, which is four cups of sugar. Let me just show you what that looks like. That was the lunch, dinner, and breakfast. So as you can see, that is just about, actually it's a little over, four cups of sugar. And we didn't have any snacks, we didn't have any sodas, we didn't have any candy bars, we didn't have any chips either. So it's just three meals is what equals this amount of sugar. You're gonna look at those black beans differently when you see, oh, a black bean burger, oh, that looks healthy. Hmm, maybe not so healthy. So back to our PowerPoint of limiting our carbs to as low as possible as necessary to burn fat. Say you need 30 to 50 grams a day from vegetable sources, which is about seven to 12 teaspoons of sugar. The primary purpose of insulin is to turn sugar into fat. So this is the Vital Balance Eating Protocol. You can find it on my website, which is vitalenergytips.com. Cutting out sugar, fruit, grains, and carbohydrates for seven days will curb your carb cravings or your sugar cravings. Protein only means no sugar, no fruit, no juice, no grains, no beans, and no starch. Protein can be eggs, meat, fish, cheese, nuts, seeds, hemp seeds, no potatoes, no tomatoes, and no yucca. So uh, let's look at breakfast. Pro uh, breakfast, the first meal of the day should be protein only. And that's actually where Nikens Kins and Vital Balance makes life super e easy because it's a meal replacement plus plus plus. We're going to talk a little bit more about that here in just a minute. But this is what I start off my day with. It has, uh, we have either vanilla or chocolate and it tastes really great. I make mine with unsweetened coconut milk. Sometimes I do it with unsweetened coconut and almond milk combination. It's whatever you like. Some people just want to do it with cold water. It's your choice. And um, I absolutely love it. In fact, a lot of times I might actually take the blender cup, put two scoops in it, and I have this in my car all the time so I can then just add my water to it wherever I am and I'm not taking a shortcut to a fast food restaurant and, and blowing my day. So that's my suggestion. So uh, protein only first thing in the morning. If you're gonna drink coffee, you can actually use uh, half and half or real cream. Milk has too many carbohydrates in it, so we do not have that on the, on the eating plan. You can also scramble eggs. You can put turkey in. In the morning, you really wanna stay away from even vegetable sources of carbohydrates because that does set up your day for cravings. That's one of the reasons you wanna do protein only in the morning is because if you're adding carbohydrates, it sets up a craving for the day. So let's look at lunch. Um, as you can see, I have the vital balance. You can have it any time of the day. It does not mean you have four a day. If you're looking to lose, say, 20 pounds, you're gonna have better results if you have two of the uh, vital balance meal replacements a day. It's gonna speed up uh, uh, your process because we know it's all good, everything that's in there. You can have a salad, and a lot of times I'll put egg salad, tuna salad, turkey salad on top of the, 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 all the lettuce and all the different vegetables. You can add in uh, hemp seeds, uh, lots of herbs, and make it very tasty. If you are not having the Vital Balance meal replacement, I do recommend taking the Digestion 420 because it does help you digest uh, fats, proteins, carbohydrates, and fiber. There's 20 different digestive enzymes in there, so it really helps to digest whatever you are eating. Dinner. Once again, seafood, chicken, turkey, beef. Uh, you can have an omelet for dinner with vegetables. And once again, it can be the vital balance. Sometimes I have busy days and I end up having a vital balance meal replacement at night after I've gotten home from the gym or maybe before I've gone to the gym. Snacks, now you do have to be prepared for this eating plan and you look at it as an adventure. It's seven days 
at a time. That's all we're saying. It's seven days at a time. And you can do anything for seven days. And after that seven days, wow, I had a great result. I lost five pounds. I'm going to keep going. I'm feeling good. I have more energy. And I have uh, one friend, great friend of mine, Heather Lapp. She lost 85 pounds in eight months, just seven days at a time. And she kept renewing her, her commitment seven days at a time. And she is somebody that really didn't believe that she would ever lose weight. And now she has more energy, she feels better, uh, her joints are not uh, hurting her like they did before. And uh, you know, an amazing uh, part of this also is she doesn't have any loose skin from losing that amount of weight in that time period, which she is just thrilled about. But she was very committed. She had oftentimes two uh, meal replacements from uh, the Vital Balance a day. She would cook a turkey and she'd go to the refrigerator and have a snack of that whenever she wanted or hard boiled eggs, uh, cutting up lots of vegetables and you just, you take a little cooler with you. So you are prepared. So it does take a little preparation and it can be an adventure in eating. So there's gonna be some foods that you may never have eaten before. You might be mashing your cauliflower and putting real butter on top of it with salt, uh, Himalayan salt and pepper. You know, so it is an adventure. It's uh, looking at life and doing things differently to get a different result. Uh, snacks, let's see, it can be frozen. That just means you add more ice cubes to it and maybe not as much liquid. And uh, uh, my great friend, Barbara Bertuzzi actually makes it into ice cream every night. Sometimes she puts toasted coconut on top and the real, uh, with a can of uh, whipped cream, it's only two grams of carbs for a tablespoon. So you can have a little fun with that also. Another snack can be a cup of soup. It can be those tuna snack packs, um, even the edamame, uh, celery, other vegetables, daikon radish, uh, even jicama with a little peanut butter or almond butter on top of it just to get you through that craving. What's really important is you take your body weight and you cut it in half, and that's how many grams of protein or more your body needs to lose weight every day. You also need that many ounces of water every day. So say you weigh 160 pounds. That means you need 80 grams of protein or more every day. You also need 80 ounces of water, and we recommend Nikon's Pimeg water every day to, uh, to lose weight. And a lot of times I found with the people that are not having the success, they're not eating enough. You should not be hungry on this. There are so many vegetables that you can add into this program and turkey and eggs and you just have a you know be an adventure there's no reason for you to get hungry oftentimes the downfall of somebody is not eating enough also let's see i also have uh, recommend real salt himalayan pink salt and for every quart of water you drink you need a quarter teaspoon of himalayan or real salt because it has 54 to 84 of the known essential minerals it's the best form of electrolytes. You're not putting the salt in the water, you're putting it on your food. You might make a little puddle and put it in your hand and you just lick it. But uh, oftentimes if individuals go to the bathroom quite rapidly after drinking water, that means they don't have enough minerals. And a lot of water out in the world does not have minerals, so we need to add them in. And this whole plan, uh, whoever is showing it to you, they can give it to you or um, you can find a copy by emailing me. There are a big list of uh, vegetables you can have. There's a couple that are restricted, eggplant, Brussels sprouts, palm hearts, wax beans, green peas, and green beans and tomatoes um, are limited to twice a week because they're a little higher in sugar. Once you do get to your weight loss goal, that's what's called phase two. And at that point, you just do one shake a day and uh, you know continue with the healthy eating. The beauty of this plan is once you learn it, you know it. So say you have a carbohydrate uh, weekend. Maybe you've had some amazing thin crust pizza. Uh, maybe you've indulged in a berry pie or whatever else might be in the world. And um, you enjoy it. You know, if you're going to eat things, you always enjoy it. And then the next day, you're back on phase one for a day or two. And you're going to get back right where you want to be by following this plan. And that's the beauty of it. That's why we call it the last diet. Once you've learned it and you get to where you want to be, then you can just reduce it. I also have a couple of support calls a week if that's something you're interested in. It's always great to grab a buddy because you're going to have four times the success if you have a friend doing it with you because it's amazing. You're more likely to commit to a stranger 
than you are yourself. Well, okay, let's call him a friend, not a stranger. So let's see, yeah, in addition to weight loss, this eating plan is designed to help uh, give your pancreas a vacation. Uh, a lot of people have also found that they've been able to uh, balance their blood sugar, which is a really important thing to do. A lot of people have noticed that they start to regain their memory, especially with booting up the brain first thing in the morning with protein only, and especially adding in the vital balance because it has a medium chain triglycerides that really help with cognitive function. So let's talk a little bit about that. Oh, here we go. This is one of the recipes that I found actually on Facebook. And I used the, un, uh, the uncured uh, lunch meat. I put in a muffin tin, I cracked an egg in it, and then I topped it off with olive tamponade and you just bake it. And each little egg cup is nine grams of protein. So it's a great snack that you can take along or you can have it for breakfast. It's something different. To find out how many grams of protein is in something, you want to go to this free app. It's called MyFitnessPal.com. So that's MyFitnessPal.com. It's also an app for your phone. And in there you can find out, well, yes, an egg has six grams of protein or how many grams of protein does this chicken breast have or this cob salad that you might be eating. So it's that way you can also log in there how much, you know, what exactly you've been eating every day, how many grams of uh, protein, how many ounces of water, and also your exercise because, uh, you know, exercise is an important part of life. So the water that we recommend is the Pimag Waterfall, and this is where you just use your own tap water. You pour it into the water filter. It takes out all the bad stuff. But it doesn't just leave it as dead strip water. It actually adds back the life, the, heavy, the uh, healthy minerals. It naturally pH balances the water on the alkaline side, about 8.5 to 9.5, depending on where you start. It does help balance out an acidic diet and the environment. It, is, it contains no BPAs. There's no concerns about chemical leaching into the water, and it's, it's totally recyclable. And that's the water we highly recommend because it's the most economical. It's actually the best for you. It's also the best for the environment. So it's something that once you have it, then you just get the replacement filters once or twice a year, depending on how many people in your house are drinking it. And when you're traveling out of town, we do have the portable bottle that you can fill up with tap water. You have to empty it even when you're going through the airport of water. And then once you get through security, you can fill it up in the restroom or the restaurant with good water and you just, uh, as, it, as you drink it, it filters it. So the Vital Balance Meal Replacement, it's a functional food. It helps people of any age stay healthy. It's designed by a team of scientists based on biological research. It supports cognitive function, contains a blend of, six, of seven en enzymes to aid digestion. There's no added salt, dairy, soy, whey, lactose, or GMO. It's vegan and kosher certified, and it is gluten-free. It does contain all natural ingredients, antioxidants, digestive enzymes, medium chain triglycerides, which is the cognitive or the mental function, a natural third generation stevia that actually tastes good. It doesn't have that bitter aftertaste, and I absolutely love the stevia that's in here and any other stevia I really don't like. I'm, I'm very... Uh, sensitive to uh, to taste. So I was so grateful that this, ta this shake tastes so amazing. It has natural vanilla, probiotics, vegetable protein, and vitamins. It does not contain added salt, sugar, animal protein, antibiotics, artificial chemicals, colorings, or flavorings, aspartame, fillers, fructose, gluten, GMOs, lactose, preservatives, soy, sucralose, whey, or yeast. It's amazing, uh, soy and whey are two of the five top allergens. So we're really grateful that Nikan does not have those in our vital balance. This is actually from 100 days of realprotein.com and it talks about different pup protein supplements that and ingredients that you want to avoid. So we have GMO, soy protein, maltodextrin, refined sugar, Whey protein isolate, heavy metals, antibiotics, RBGH, which are hormones, artificial colorings, and carrageenan. And there's a lot of different check marks with a lot of different shakes that are at the market, whether you're um, wherever you might be shopping. 
But Vital Balance here on the bottom is the only one that doesn't have any of those ingredients, ingredients that we're very grateful for. Now the details. Once again, just to remember, take your body weight, cut it in half. This is how many grams of protein your body needs every day. And don't forget, also that many ounces of water every day. This offers 18 grams of organic vegetable protein per serving from pea, chlorella, hemp, and rice providing a complete protein. Helps formation of lean body mass. There's no saturated fat or the calories of animal protein. The magic medium chain triglycerides. This is the fat that makes you thin from natural palm oil, which also contains antioxidants. Converted to ketone bodies by the liver to go directly to, to the brain and the heart. There's no impact on insulin levels. It triggers thermogenesis that increases metabolic rate. Supports mental acuity by providing an immediate brain tissue nourishment and cell replenishment. If used with water first thing in the morning, ketone bodies from MCTs bypass glucose breakdown to produce energy. Protein increases tyrosine, which promotes alertness and energy. Do not mix with carbohydrates such as milk, juice, fruit, etc. as they cause fatigue by increasing tryptophan used to make serotonin, which calms. This is not what you want in the morning. It's not what you want your kids to have in the morning either. Benefits linked between MCTs and memory problems associated with aging according to clinical research. Helps control appetite and it really does appear to make you happier. I've noticed a couple days when I didn't have it, I actually went and had it because I wasn't as happy as I was when I was drinking it. Probiotics in the vital balance. There are 100 trillion bacteria in the gut. Good bacteria preventing harmful microbes from entering the body. Helps digest carbohydrates. Helps absorb minerals, produces certain vitamins, responsible for absorbing more than 10% of daily calories. Contributes to healthy immune function. Each serving contains over 2 billion probiotics. Yogurt, pickles, and sauerkraut increase the same good bacteria. One serving of Vital Balance contains more helpful bacteria than 10 containers of yogurt. So one Vital Balance or 10 containers of yogurt that would have a lot of sugar. Natural organic detoxifiers. There are natural and man-made man -made toxins in our physical environment. Cilantro and open cell chlorella recognized as beneficial in assisting removal of heavy metals from the body. Synergistic combination with organic alfalfa, spirulina, broccoli, and spinach also contain in vital balance. And here is the summary. Better than other meal replacements on the market for memory, attitude, fat loss, and nutritional supplementation. It is not just a shake. It's a shake plus, 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 plus. 18 grams of vegetable protein from pea, chlorella, hemp, and rice. Remember, it's vegan. 125 calories per serving. Magic medium chain triglycerides for direct heart and brain energy. Natural heavy metal detoxification with chlorella and cilantro. Probiotics for digestion and immune health, very important. Digestive enzymes for better breakdown and absorption. And, uh, you know, an interesting point on this, once again, pea protein sometimes is hard to digest because Nikan put digestive enzymes in here. You do not have to worry about that because they have thought of all of that. That's the beauty of working with the Health and Research Institute. Vitamins and mineral supplementation contains your daily green vegetables, great vanilla taste with third generation stevia, and cost is just $2.50 a serving. And another important point on this is if you are, um, if you're having one uh, shake a day, you're not spending more money at the grocery store or you're just actually replacing the money you've been spending at the grocery store for one week. So if you're having one shake a day, that's equal to one week of going to the grocery store of what you're actually spending on the shake. And 30 meals for $75, I spend more than that at the grocery store a week. So that's a great deal. So if you're having two shakes a day, that's actually equal to uh, two weeks of going to the grocery store. So it can actually be more economical and it's actually extremely healthy for you. Now, every liver needs a little support. Have you heard of having a fatty liver? I hadn't really before, but there's a lot of people that seem to have, know all about this and have that challenge. 
Every liver needs a little support. A sluggish liver slows down the body's ability to release weight, often a sign of this is cellulite. Meekin's liver support is simple to use. Just three capsules a day enhances the liver's activity. More liver issues, double the dose. And the last thing I'm gonna talk about here is the 10-4. This is an organic, natural energy. Wake up your body and mind the healthy way. Kenzen 10-4 is made with real ingredients, including nature's own energy drink, naturally organic matcha green tea. Whether it's 10 a.m. or 5 p.m., you'll experience up to six hours of energy. A feeling that supercharges your, you mentally and physically. 10-4 offers 80 milligrams of natural alkaline caffeine and is made with organic ingredients. It helps burn calories, boost metabolism, and supports mental alertness. With vitamins B6 and B12 for quick pickup and nutrient-rich kiwi, Kenzen 10-4 has only 25 calories and a light tropical tea taste that you can enjoy any time of the day. There's no artificial flavors, sweeteners, colors, or preservatives. It's real energy, pure delight, and only $1.75 a packet, opposed to some of those that are very acidic. And um, I love the 10-4. It's a, it's, a, it's a very calming, natural energy. It's uh, what the Buddhist monks actually used to meditate. So it's that like high in life feeling. And uh, you just add the little packet to water. Sometimes if I'm driving down the road and I need a little energy boost, I'll do half a packet with my, and then I swish it with water. And okay, that's a little hardcore, but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do depending on where you're at. But this enhances everything that you're doing that's um, nutritionally good for you. So it's just boosting everything that you're already doing. So this is the Vital Balance Eating Plan and we've been doing it for a number of years. We have great success. You feel better, you have more energy. And if you are eating something that may not be on the eating plan, feel good about it. And then the next day you just get back on your plan and you'll be where you wanna be. Oh, one more point. Okay, so those of you that like to have a cocktail, ah, drinking wine and beer, you just can't lose weight if you're doing that. So, okay, people are always looking for an alternative and I'm not encouraging anybody to drink anything, but if you're gonna be doing it anyway, you just do a club soda, vodka or rum tequila and club soda and lime or lemon and that's very low carb you do not want to do it every day i'm not telling you to do it every day or even every week but if you are wanting to have a little toast that's what you can do something to remember if you have had a carb festival and had too many carbohydrates do not get on the scale for three days because it will not be a happy it will not be happy news because your body stores three days worth of carbohydrates. Wait until you know, get back on the plan and then three days after that, then get back on the scale. So have fun with it, be creative, ask for help, get a buddy, and uh, we'll see you on the Neekin Highway. Thank you for your time.